γεύσαστε και είδατε ότι Χριστός ο Κύριος. Taste and see that the Lord is good. Αγαπητοί μου χριστιανοί, αδερφοί και αδερφές, my beloved Christians, brothers and sisters, Γεύσαστε και είδατε ότι Χριστός ο Κύριος. Taste and see that the Lord is good. Αγαπητοί μου χριστιανοί, αδερφοί και αδερφές, my beloved Christians, brothers and sisters. Today is arguably one of the most poignant and well-known Gospels heard in all the world. Do unto others as you would have them do unto you. It has been come to be known as the golden rule. It is that lesson that we get, whether we like it or not, throughout our whole entire life. We get this lesson because by the fall of our first fallen parents, Adam and Eve, we all fall, we all sin, we all make mistakes. And so since we make mistakes, we find it much more easy, if we are wise, to forgive the sins of others. And this is the first thing that some of the fathers would have us understand about this golden rule. Do unto others as you would have them do unto you. Forgive others as you would hope that they would forgive you. For the love of Christ, we strive. We strive day in and day out to come closer to him. Wisdom gives us to know that we don't live forever. Our bodily fragility, our weaknesses, our illnesses give us to understand that we don't live forever. Having lost loved ones, ourselves, we observe that there is death ultimately in this life. And so we use that to our advantage. We use all these things to our advantage as God has given us by these beautiful lessons like today and like every day, to try to be humble, to try to be loving, to try to be like God who is merciful. Let us continue to do that each and every day. And let us not be like those who are self-centered and egotistical that only want God to help them accomplish certain things or to help them see good things happening in their families or to have success in business or in school. Let us be wise, humble servants of the Lord and ask Him to give us grace to overcome our weaknesses as we try to forgive others theirs. Amen.